As the planet heats up, scientists remind us that we have the technology to decrease the CO2 emissions from generation of heat and electricity. Andritz Feed and Biofuel holds this technology and we have the solution. The 100,000 plus tons of straw pellets produced at this biomass plant is just one of the many initiatives around the globe in the mission to decrease CO2 emissions from generation of heat and electricity. This video will show you how straw is transformed into biomass that powers your home through the technology and machinery supplied by Andritz Feed and Biofuel. The straw arrives by truck, and once the truck is in the correct position, the driver will activate the green button. Pushing the green button activates the straw crane and alarms the area so no one can enter it. The straw crane is positioned using this remote control, and from this point on, the straw crane is fully automated. Once activated, the straw crane moves into the correct position. To measure the moisture within the straw using microwave technology, controlled from the straw hall control room, where moisture over 16% in average is rejected. Straw tested for moisture is automatically transported along the straw table to the shredder. There are three shredders, complete with automatic string cutter within the plant, which keep the lines constantly moving. The shredders cut the straw into fine particles and also extract any foreign objects, such as stones or metals. Shredded straw is transferred into one of three grinder rooms, where it is ground into extra fine particles five millimeters in diameter. Ground straw is extracted from the hammer mills by use of filters, securing optimum extraction and no emission of dust from the plant. The conveyors from the filter secure a safe and fast transportation of the straw particles to the pre-bin with a double discharge screw for constant feed to the conditioners where steam is added to activate the lignin in the straw to stick the material to pellets. The steamed material is passed to the presses, where the straw is made into 8mm pellets. The friction from dies and rolls being pushed together induce heat to the material. Using these unique dies and rolls, securing a hard and uniform pellet. The straw pellets are transported to the cooler, for bringing the pellets to ambient temperature for storage purposes. Just before storage, the pellets pass through a sieve which rejects any non-conforming sizes, which are passed back through the whole process, ensuring 100% output. The uniform straw pellets are transferred into the two 300-ton silos, where trucks are filled, ready for transportation to the power plant. The whole site is fully automated using PLCs and automatic control systems, which means the plant is manned by only three people. From the control room, the plant operators can see exactly how the lines are running and react to any delays using this sophisticated computer system. So as the raw material completes its transformation from straw bales to biomass fuel, the next time you turn the TV on or switch on a light, it could all be thanks to the technology and machinery supplied by Andritz Feed and Biofuel.